Kai Zhutong lights it up on home snow in Secret Garden, China. Scotty James is the man of the moment in men's snowboard halfpipe. The big names were out in force for the first of five snowboard handpipes in the 2023-2024 season on the site of the 2022 Olympic Winter Games. Maddie Mastro's best run was her first run. She threw down with some serious style and stuck the double crippler as well. 88.5 was her score, and she finished in third place. Lu Ziyu was making her first start since Beijing 2022, and it was a dream return. Coming into the contest, she was tied with Dorian Vidal on 23 World Cup podiums. The second place result means she's now third on the all-time list. Kai Zhutong is a three-time world champion and the current world champion. Today she was flawless, dreamlike style, solid execution, and bags of amplitude and technical wizardry. She took the victory in fine style. Only woman to go into the 90s, 93.25. A one-two for China, USA in third. I feel so good and I'm so proud of myself to land in my sec uh, third run. Yeah, and uh, good weather, good pipe and the crawl is really nice. Yeah, I'm so happy. Kai Zhutong now needs one more win to tie for the most in snowboard handpipe history. Good conditions in the pipe today meant the world's best who were absolutely on fire. And they don't come much better than Scotty James, the Australian Olympic silver medalist, went big on the first run. Switch back, McTwist, pull back to forward is a new trick, and it set the tone for a phenomenal run and victory. Brooker Hirano took three wins last season on his way to the Crystal Globe. His best run here was close, but not enough. Brooker has the back-to-back -back 14s, but today wasn't quite his day, and he ended up in second place, just behind Scotty James. Jian Lee shocked the snowboard world, claiming the half-pipe and world championships last season, and today he got his first World Cup podium. Massive triple set the tone and he never looked back as he improved the score to cement his place on the podium. Scotty James on the top step in Secret Garden, China. Yeah, it uh, feels like a bit of redemption for sure from the games, but uh, I've always had a really good time here in Secret Garden. Halfpipe is incredible and honestly today was as, as heavy as a show as the Olympics. Everyone really brought it and uh, had to bring my best. Uh, really awesome to share the podium with these boys and yeah, it's been a, been a fun day for sure. Scotty James now has eight World Cup wins, the third most of any man. The next Snowboard Halfpipe World Cup is on the 14th of December in Copper Mountain. Download the new Fizz app for more.